Hi guys, so welcome to Electronic Curiosity. So today I am going to build a simple circuit using Arduino Nano and some LEDs to make a chaser effect. So let's build a circuit on breadboard. So I have an Arduino Nano with me. In this circuit you can see a simple connections. So I am connecting my breadboard, uh, Arduino Nano on breadboard. I am going to use 11 LEDs uh, which are going to create my chaser effect. In my program I have set uh, counter as 14 but I am going to use 11 uh, LEDs. So you can change that. The code for this uh, circuit will be provided in the uh, description. The link will be provided in the description. You can check my uh, website uh, and I, where I have I, I have been uploading my codes and for different chaser effects. So so this will be a first video on chaser effect. I am going to provide more uh, such video on chaser effect. So you can uh, find more videos related to this. If you like my video, you can subscribe to my channel Electronic Curiosities and share this video. So let's connect the digital pin, uh, my LED to the digital pin. So I am connecting to digital D2, the positive pin, uh, pin of uh, terminal of uh, LED to my digital pin of Arduino board. So similarly I can connect, uh, you can connect uh, all the positive terminal to the digital pin and negative terminal to, uh, is common to a ground. So that uh, ground is connected from the Arduino board to the uh, one pin uh, which is common to the all LEDs. So similarly I am uh, connecting positive terminal of LED to the uh, D, D, D3 of Arduino board and it goes on so I am using 11 LED so you can see the good chaser effect here I am not using a register uh, because uh, it will make the circuit more bulkier so this is the simplest way you can do if you want to add a register then you can add of course 450 ohm register to protect your LED but now uh, here uh, this is a 5 mm LED and it can handle the current so I am not adding, uh, adding a register here so uh, now let's pass forward this connection and let uh, let me the, see the code part also so for the code you can refer to the link in the description and check the code so that's it so let's see now the
let's see the coding part so you can see we have the code so let's see from the beginning in counter so this will set a counter uh, for our LED so we have a 14 digital pins in the board so I have set a counter to 14 but I have used only 11 pins here so you can set this to 11 or uh, you can uh, set a 14 also no problem now we have used here for loop for uh, each LED so I set to 0, I is less than counter and I plus plus 2 so consider as each LED then the pin mode is I set to the output for all LEDs then again we have used here function that is flash which will call back when we need it so in flash function we have int LED in duration so it will write digitally write the LED high and it will give de some delay in duration and it will again go LED as a low and you can see a delay duration is there so let's see in the void loop uh, we have used again a for loop that is uh, i is equal to zero i is less than counter and i plus plus so it will glow, glow the each LED uh, for the flash which we have set this as a function here in the first so this is a function flash will call back uh, and again glow the LED for 20 milliseconds you can change this time to any you want 30 or maybe uh, 40 uh, just I'm taking as a uh, 20 so now let me connect my board to the my laptop and upload this code to uh, Arduino Nano So I connected my board let's select this go to tools and select your board so select uh, as Arduino Nano if you are using Arduino Uno you can select Arduino Uno I am using Arduino Nano so let's select Arduino Nano then again go to tools uh, select your processor that is a processor for your Arduino Nano that is 8, 8 mega 8 mega 3 to 8p for old, old book loader and select your port uh, based on your computer requirement uh, uh, computer so, uh, gives to your Arduino Nano so I, I have a COM5 so select I will select it to COM5 and I will just uh, click on upload code to the board so click on upload and it will upload here you can see and my board is connected to Arduino on you know, COM5 port com5 so after uploading you will see the chaser effect on your circuit from your on your circuit and you can change the, uh, change the sp speed of that chaser uh, on and off of the LED duration here you can uh, uh, there is 20 you can make it for 30 or 40 and see the change so that's it if you like this video subscribe to my channel and share this video to your friends so thank you for watching my video